is Paul. Yes. Mm -hmm. Just uh, waiting to go to church. Yeah. Now, uh, the ping that I was telling you about, how I kind of found out that state-of-the-art statue that the uh, Chinese uh, business person's chamber of commerce had donated to the airport. Yes, yes, yes. Huh. Why don't you look through the airports, the big commercial airports, SeaTac? Yes. Mm -hmm. The small airports, Fairchild, and then there's an airport in Carlsberg. Thank you for reminding me of that. Pooch. Now, I know. You can't approach a house. How do they know who's going to be there before they get there? <laughs> there could be some top secret technology, maybe a fire station in Carlsberg, just a block and a half or two blocks down from Maryland's house. Yes. Now, when you think about these big antennas that emergency medical services has, the M... Well... There's no way that you could get every cell phone number just because you're a fire department and somebody <laughs> drives by within oh, 10,000 feet. You know, I was talking to a person mm -hmm, mm, last night, actually, and she'd gotten a restraining order against a guy that was stalking her, and she said it was 1,000 feet, and I thought, you know what? <laughs> I think I was wrong. Yes, maybe it is 1,000 uh, feet is just normal. Uh-huh. Because I explained a thousand feet is a football field, too, because a yard is three feet. Yes, <laughs> and there's a hundred yards. That's three hundred feet. Uh, I guess I was wrong on that too. <laughs> uh, I better clarify that when I talk to her because it's actually three football fields plus an additional hundred feet. <laughs> now that I think about it, a, a football field is a hundred yards. Yes. It is. <laughs> And 100 yards times 3 is 300 feet, and 3 football fields would be 900 feet, and you'd have to add another 100 feet to it to, to get 1,000 feet. I was, I was wrong in what I told her. I, well, you know, I don't know exactly, okay. But uh, when we look for these uh, technologies, yes, well, there's the Squim Fire Department. How are you guys? How are you? Did you do you have an antenna that happens to be connected to any technology that can get the ping of any phone that gets within oh a thousand feet of a fire station? <laughs> there wouldn't be any top secret ping detectors on any fire stations in the United States of America. <laughs> Why don't we go through all the fire stations? Oh, volunteer firemen, pooch, fire women, sorry, gender specific. Ouch! Why don't you just give me the GPS location of the actual residences of both the volunteers and the employees of every fire department of this great nation? Well, let's say you're at home, okay? You're a fire, you're, 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 you're a volunteer, yes. And uh, you find out there's a three-alarm fire going off someplace, five-alarm. I don't even know the alarm system of the fire department. Pooch. But it's one of these where you're in the family and <laughs> you got to know. You got to know before you get there. Yes, you do. <laughs> now, just give me uh, the actual locations, the GPS locations of every resident, of every volunteer and employee of every fire department throughout the nation. <laughs> I'd mentioned that I thought they were mandatory reporters, and <laughs> when I pointed out this fraud of issuing court orders, <laughs> you know, they're, you're a fire commissioner, are you? <laughs> you're sitting at home right now wondering why it is that you can see what I'm saying? Yes! It could be that you have a top secret ping detector at your personal residence, and why? <laughs> You don't want anybody approaching you without having the knowledge of who they are. And you thought, well, if I get their cell phone number, I know that they're a thousand feet away. That's a pretty large ping detector you have there. Yes, it is. Now, if you could, just give me all the ping detectors of every employee of every fucking fire department. <laughs>